Hey, I'm Grayson, and in this video, I'm gonna show you how I make these nice chopsticks out of recycled skateboards. So I've gone through my stock of skateboards, and I've chosen these here to make chopsticks out of because they have unique ply patterns. This one's like mostly black and gray colors. These have horizontal and vertical plies on these long boards. This one just has a few nice colors in it, so they'll make the prettiest chopsticks. First bit of the process is gonna to be to remove the grip tape. So we'll head over to the heater to do that. So I'm gonna let these heat up for 10 or 15 minutes. Um, if you got questions about the degripping process, I've got a separate YouTube video that goes into detail about that whole process. This one's plenty hot. You don't always get this lucky, but it's a real treat when you do it, it comes off this easily. So because these different types of skateboards are shaped differently, um, these have a, a, a straight edge and these have a curved edge, I'm going to cut them a little differently. So for the long boards, I'm going to cut them down the middle and then joint them so I have a, a straight edge to reference off of my table saw fence. This one, I don't need to do that since I already have that straight edge. So my first step is going to be to mark a line down the center of these long boards and then cut that. They're, they're pretty straight, but they're not perfectly straight. So to make them perfectly straight, I'm going to joint them on my joiner, and then I'll have a perfectly straight line to reference on my table saw fence. All right, so now that I've cut them into strips, I'm gonna cut them to length so that you're not trying to eat with chopsticks this size. I'm gonna do that on my chop saw, and I'm gonna just clamp up a stop block so that I can make consistent cuts and get them all the exact same length nice and easily. The next few steps are all gonna be on this chopstick jig. The first thing I'm gonna do for that is to sharpen the blade on this little plane. So we're gonna do that first. So at this point, it's a long square that tapers down from a large end to a small end. And I'm, at this next step, I'm going to taper the small end into an octagon. So it's a nice round edge to grab onto your food. So as you can see, I'm taking it from this square tip to this octagonal tip. So for the next step, I'm gonna use this piece of 320 grit sandpaper. I'm just gonna scuff these up a little bit and break these hard edges because they're a little sharp. Take down any rough spots and then get them ready for some finish.
So that's my process for making chopsticks out of skateboards. I'm gonna finish up this batch off camera and then I'll get these all uploaded on my website, greyhoundgoods.com, if you wanna get some for yourself or a gift for a friend. And then uh, if you want to like or subscribe to the channel, it helps us out a ton. Thanks so much and we'll see you in the next one. Ha, 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 ha.